I'm almost there. You're in the back, you said? Yes. There's a parking lot. You'll see a bunch of cars. I'm like, all right. I haul into the parking lot where majority of people are parked. There is no blockade at that entrance. There normally is. No blockade. So I'm just in the Buick. Just I get I get past the guard shack, whatever you call it. And I'm going through there. And I'm like, at the time, I kind of glanced in my rear view mirror. And I was like, well, that's funny. A guy, a guy waving me down. He was kind of running at me looking back now. <laughs> I know why he was running at me, but I was just like, ah, I don't I don't have time to talk to nobody. My buddies want McDonald's and I want a duck hunt. So probably didn't even have anything license wise to duck hunt. And <laughs> I'm driving and I call my buddy again and I'm like, hey, I don't see no parking lot are you sure you're in, like, I'm going the right way? He's like, yes, you can't miss it. We're like the last spot. I'm like, okay. I'm like, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a lot of duck blinds. And he's like, no, just keep going. I'm like, okay. So I'm driving and I'm like, there's people coming out of the duck blinds and they're like, what the fuck? What? <laughs> you know? And I'm like waving at them like, man, hope you guys are having a good day, you know? I mean, I'm, I'm shocked I didn't get shot at. And I get to the wagon. They left the wagon in the middle of the road. And I'm like, boy, they didn't say anything about a wagon being in my way. <laughs> so I called again, third time. I said, hey, I said, I am at a wagon that is blocking the road. And they were like, a wagon's blocking the road? He's like, yeah, just go around it, I guess, but I don't know why they blocked the road. So I go, I haul off into this, like, grown-up CRP stuff in this Buick. Just, <laughs> just ridiculous. Like, if you would have had a GoPro, if you would have been anybody out there that was there that remembers this, send me a video on Facebook, because I'm sure you probably still have it. <laughs> you still talk to your friends and family about it. But I rolled past that wagon and I'm like going and all of a sudden I get a call from my buddy. I pick it up. I'm like, God, hello. And they're like, oh my God, you got to turn around. You are in the wrong, you're on the wrong road, dude. Like you're on, you're on their duck hunting road. Like you've ruined everybody's hunt. <laughs> like there's been 15 people called in already and said that there's a Buick Regal in the duck flying zone and i'm like i told i called you three times and they're like no turn around i couldn't turn around there's there's levees and dams like i was like stuck <laughs> so i'm in the buick and i'm like i'm starting to get nervous i'm, I'm like boys i'm going to jail like i know and i come up to the gate where the other side of the gate says do not enter and i get out and i look at the lock and it's dummy lock i I would have been scotch free if I would have just looped it and went out. But I looked at it and it looked locked. So I'm like, oh, they got the damn gate locked. <laughs> so I reversed my car probably a half a mile. Like everybody at TC still knows like how long that lane is. I drove all the way in reverse. And as I'm driving in reverse back to the guard shack, I look back and there is two COs standing like Paul Bart security standing, <laughs> waiting for this car to come back. And there's a there was some guy, Gingerhead. He was just waiting to tear me a new one. And I'm like, oh my gosh. I was like, here we go. I was like, so I pulled up and I rolled the window down. And he's like, do you know <laughs> what you have just done? And I'm like, I have a bit of a feeling i know but please tell me like because i he said what are you doing here and my buddies called me on the way back and they're like tell them you were bird watching i'm like yeah 21 year old man <laughs> with guns in his cars in camo and i'm just bird watching like it's not lining up 